Uh, thank you for being here, Chairman Watt. I want to return to an issue that Senator Menendez raised, and that is, as you know, five million families lost their homes during the financial crisis, and millions more are still struggling. According to the latest data from CoreLogic, a leading housing market research firm, another 5.3 million homeowners remain underwater on their homes, and people are continuing to lose their homes every day in foreclosure. Now, we talk a little bit about the law here. One of your duties under the law is to preserve and uh, conserve the assets of Fannie and Freddie, but another duty given equal importance by Congress, and I'm reading from the law here, is to implement a plan that seeks to maximize assistance for homeowners and take advantage of available programs to minimize foreclosures. Congress explicitly included reduction of loan principal as an option for your agency to pursue. Principal reduction is often a win-win that both helps Fannie and Freddie and helps a family. A 2013 CBO study, for example, found that even a modest principal reduction plan for Fannie and Freddie mortgages could help 1.2 million underwater homeowners prevent 43,000 defaults and save Fannie and Freddie about $2.8 billion. The Treasury Department has found that principal reductions could save Fannie and Freddie nearly $4 billion and help half a million homeowners stay in their home. It has been six years since Congress created FHFA, and in all that time, your agency has never, not once, permitted a family to reduce its principal mortgage through Fannie or Freddie. I've asked about this repeatedly, and you've said you'd look into uh, allowing Fannie and Freddie to engage in principal reduction. You said it again today. You've been in office for nearly a year now, and you haven't helped a single family, not even one, by agreeing to a principal reduction. So I want to know why this has not been a priority for you. Um, the data are there. <laughs> uh, I, it, it's probably an overstatement, Senator Warren, to say it's not been a priority. Uh, it has been a priority. It's just a very difficult issue. And um, the reason it's difficult is because we are looking for exactly what you said, which is a win win situation. Well, it, um, forgive we, me, though. So, so um, we, we have to do this in a way that is responsible. Otherwise, we just reduce principal for everybody across the board is not, is not what anybody, I think, is advocating for. So then we have to decide, okay, what is a responsible Chairman way Watt, to do Chairman you it? have had a year to do that. You've known for five years before that what the problem was. We have two studies coming out showing that Fannie and Freddie could make money by doing this, one from the Treasury Department and one from the CBO. I'm not even talking about all the private studies on this. In the meantime, during this year, you've done the reps and warranties policy, you've done the buyback policy, you've done private mortgage insurance rules, you've done a whole list of really tough technical things, and I applaud you for doing that, but people have lost their homes in the last year. And every day that you delay, more families lose their homes. There are 5.4 million families out there underwater. So I want to know, when are you going to have an answer on this one? Uh, we're, going, uh, we're going to have the answer um, sooner. It won't be as long as it has been. Let me put it that way. Uh, you know, um, how, how many more people have to lose I, their homes? I, I can't before take we responsibility for what what decisions were made in the first five years. I can't no, take responsibility for what decisions are made in the last year. And uh, it's not a year yet, but uh, I think we are getting closer to. And we are doing some things that really. Um, may not call themselves uh, principal reduction, but we are giving a lot more flexibility through the Neighborhood Stabilization Initiative. Well, um, it, but they are not principal reduction, so let's just be it, They are. About they that. are principal reduction. If we, if we facilitate the transfer of, of loans to 
other entities that do principal reduction and allow them to do principal reduction, that is principal reduction. Look, uh, it is not across the board principal reduction. Indeed, how many families has it affected? Uh, I mean, it has affected a number of, uh, of We've got 5.4 yeah. million families outstanding with underwater loans. And we've got two principal studies now showing what would happen if Fannie and Freddie would engage in principal reduction.